Hi guys, in today's video we're going to be looking at the system status bar for TrueCut already works. But before that, let's have a quick intro first. So today's video can be found on softwaretraining.ca.za. We make short and easy to watch problem solving videos and we also have daily updates. Otherwise, we head back in the program here. Now, just a quick reminder for those that are new. This is a mini series on the graphical user interface. Or should I say overview of it. And then um, we will also leave relevant links in the description so you guys can follow along. Now, we've already covered most of the UI for the program. So today we're going to be looking at the system status bar. And uh, this is a very handy bar to gather information about your project. So if we had to go um look here at the bottom of our screen you can see we've got this nice little welcome message and then um, this is the status bar on the right here we have some more information so if we move across here i don't know if you can see it there but you can actually see a live update of what's busy happening then um unfortunately like most other programs it does not show you the information of when you're creating something new so if I do create this box on the bottom left, you will see, we don't see any updates. It's still only on our right here. We're showing the crosshair um, position and a welcome message. But if we had to navigate over any icon or uh, through menus, if you keep an eye here on the bottom, so let's go to file and we go to new, then it'll say create a new document. Go to open, opens an existing document. So this is great. If you add a tool, you're not quite sure, it'll just um, give you a, a basic description of what it is. So cut optimize and it says optimize part of selected curves, which can be quite useful. So it's a bit of a, almost like a tooltip type menu, but it is not a tooltip. Tooltip is when you hover on something and it pops up that little tooltip. So, uh, but yeah. Then also if we had to go on the left here, same way you can hover, you can see it says tool for selection. The next one, tool for node edit. So this is a great way to also explore the program. So if you have to use something you're not sure, you just hover on it and then it will tell you on the bottom there what it's um, useful. But otherwise, yeah, that is a basic overview on the system status bar. You can get a lot of your information here. So just keep an eye there um, when you're doing new actions on that. You might actually see some uh, more relevant information there. Otherwise, we are to head here to softwaretraining.co.za. You guys will notice we've got a variety of different softwares we do cover. And also you can isolate your search on the top right. If you do not, however, find the video you're looking for, you can always go here, request a training video, and then fill in the mini form and we will make that video for you. But otherwise, thanks guys for watching and cheers.